die. I'm trying to be a little bit careful and not shoot too many shots. Oh my God. If I can help it. Holy crap, that was amazing. What is up the world? What up, peeps? It is your friendly neighborhood Slipgator here, hanging out today, doing stuff, doing things, back with some more Void Train, and we must make some consumable rings, ladies and gentlemen. Let's make three of those bad hombres. That should be 15 more. We got five in there, total of 20 rings. So yeah, welcome back, everybody. Nice to see you, and thanks for coming to hang out, uh, like I said, for another episode of Void Train. Um, in the last episode, we got, I don't know why I was so excited. In the last episode, we hit a couple of islands. We finished a couple of puzzles and we got a couple of these chests. Uh, we've yet to make it to a new void area or a, a new, uh, depot area. Uh, and so we haven't been able to open those guys yet. I'm very excited to see if we can get some more and we have the opportunity to do that. There are, bam, right there. How do we got, what do we got? 20 now? So right over here, there are, uh, more fireflies and that means more islands. So we've got to make our way over this way to get that going. Um, also wanted to take a second to give a shout out to everybody who helps support the channel and however, in however, however it is that you choose to do that. Thank you all very much for smashing that like button and subscribing and doing all the things. You guys continue to be amazing. Uh, we had a couple new patrons sign up as well. Thank you guys very, very much for that. Um, all right. So uh, this actually looks like it might be a little bit far away. Even though it tells you that you're going to green. Like even though, because here you can see it's yellow. means it's not going to hit. That's green. And then like, can we get a red? Well, sometimes red. And that means you can't uh, you can't go there. Even though this says green, it doesn't always actually mean you'll be able to reach it. Looks like I'm doing a pretty good job here. Subscribe for more. Um I could probably hold this button down as well. Maybe we come down here. All right, here we go. So the question always is whenever we get to one of these areas, uh, see like this, for instance, that looks pretty far. Oh, we still can get it, man. That's amazing. So the question always is, um, can we, or how many puzzles are there? Actually, pardon me. That's what we're trying to really figure out here is how many of these puzzles we've got. Let's go ahead and pop up over here as well. Uh, you can have either one, two, or three in any of these areas. So let me see here. Let's go up like this. And let's start to take a look and see. Okay, so I can definitely see that there's a puzzle over that way. And remember, we can shoot out the boards and stuff like that. Uh, uh, let me see the best way to get over there. It looks like I'm actually going to have to head over this way. And that this is odd. I can't... Ooh, I can't reach that guy. Uh, oh, this is very, very odd. I can't reach that guy. Can I reach that? Well, I might be able to get over there. Did it not hit? No, we actually have two over there. There we go. I got it. That's going to be a little bit tricky getting back. But yeah, so it looks like right over this way, we've got uh, another puzzle. Um, and this looks like uh, one of the laser puzzles. There's different lasers that we have to line up. And these guys are pretty cool. Uh, they get, if I'm not mistaken, progressively harder as we move forward here. So this might actually be tough. We shall see what goes on here. All right, so it looks like we can get inside of here. And then it looks like right here, you know what we might need to do? We might need to go ahead and pop off some of these. Like so and like so, just to make sure we can see everything. Let's rotate this guy around. Now, it looks like the obvious spot for this is right here, right like that, but it, it, it might not be. It might not always be the obvious place. Uh, I'm going to break these boards out just to see. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything behind it. So that's probably not where we need to go. I saw another grapple point right over here. Let's go ahead and pop over and grab that. And let's take a look at this guy. This guy turns this into a single laser. And then there's another single laser right here as well. Can I... Mm, maybe I have to drop this guy over here. Go like this. All right. Let's take a look at this guy. So this is leading me to believe something weird's going on here. These... Are, oh, this one can go up and down as well. Mm, that probably needs to go somewhere else. Oh, I can't get that? Weird. I wonder why. I wonder why that doesn't work. So I'm going to place this guy over here for right now. I have a sneaking suspicion that's not how this is supposed to work, but let's go ahead and edit this one as well. Now, this yellow one, we can't go up and down with it. So only... Oh, oh, oh. Weird. Weird. Hold on. So this guy won't go up and down, and then I can't... Act is this a bug? So I can't activate that. I can't activate that. It looks like this probably needs to go there if I had to take a wild guess. Now let's pop this guy off. Oh wait, and that yellow one's not lighting that up. Dude, this is weird, man. Hold on a second here. You aren't lighting this up? Are you sure about that? Do I have to like get it? 
Huh, I can't access that or that. Oh, there we go. Okay, we got that guy. All right, so now we know what's going on with that. That guy's still not working. So let's put this guy back over where he was before. Hopefully that goes there. All right, I'm very excited to access the hairball. Okay, so now we got this guy. Let's take a look at... I feel like I know where this is going to go. If we pop this one this way, can we access both of those? Look at that. See? He's done it. Unbelievable and amazing. All right, that guy lines up to this. I feel like we were almost there, guys. We just got to turn a couple of these guys around and we should be good to go. Like so. You go there. And then the red laser. And then we get the Chewbacca? Can we get the Chewbacca? Come over this way. Oh, wait. I feel like we have just at the last second moved the laser in the correct direction. I'm not very good at that. All right. It's fine. Not everybody's good at everything. Let's move over this way. Let's see what we got here. We'll grab that. And then we'll grab this. So there's also a quality to these chests, and that chest right there is kind of a lower quality chest. So uh, it's all good, though. We get stuff and things from everything, uh, all the things, all the chests. Uh, now I've got to bring it back. And what I want to do before I do that, though, is I do want to just double check and see if there are any other puzzles around here. Uh, I don't want to bring the chest all the way back and come all the way back out here just to learn that there aren't any more puzzles. Uh, but I can only carry one of the chests at a time. So... Pop this guy over here. Let's go ahead and see. Can we make it? Is there an anchor point inside of here? And then can I just squeeze? Can I get a squeeze through there? Let me see. I'm going to do a little bit of exploring here. Back to the train. And we have just the one. So there was only one puzzle in that area over there. We can pop over here and then go ahead and place this guy down in this area like so. So there we go. We got three of those chests. Uh, and we are ready to rock and roll with a bunch of other stuff and things. By the way, uh, if you just for an update for you, all of our resources, we are really full on everything. Uh, we actually have a lot of extra wood as well. Uh, I am going to go ahead and drop these guys into there. We can make a little bit more grease and a couple more ingots. But remember over here, there's a couple things we're doing at the same time. We always want to make sure we have enough stuff in order to do uh, an upgrade or not an upgrade to upgrade the train. So we always want to make sure we have enough stuff to upgrade the train. Uh, and we have two springs, two bolts, two bearings, and I think we need four ingots as well. Uh, but in addition to, let's call this the four ingots. I got 10 there. I got two there. I got uh, 22 more. So if we take a look inside of here, remember this upgrade was massive. So it was 8, 16, 24. Uh, a couple more. Let me see here. Actually, whoa. Can we do this right now? I feel like we might be able to do this right now. Let's go like so. Let's do two of these. That'll be like all of my additional iron. But we could at least research the steam engine, um, which is one of the things that I want to try to get right away. I'm assuming if this costs this much to research, it's going to cost a huge amount in order to make as well. Uh, but I think we can start to maybe get this guy going. I'm not going to take anything out uh, from uh, my backup iron. I don't want to deal with accidentally running out of enough things in order to make uh, another uh, addition to the train. But this looks like this is a good amount. 10, 20, 24. I think we're good to go. Let me go ahead and craft up a bunch of stuff and things. And my math was incorrect because these aren't all iron. Uh, these guys right there, there's four copper. Those are pipes, even though they look like wire. So four copper pipes need to be created. And we have everything we need right now. So not as much iron. That's a good thing. Let's go ahead and unlock that guy. Bam and bam. And the big thing is, even though I don't know when we're going to build this or how that's going to work, the cool thing about this is this unlocks the next tier for us. So, ooh, smelter two, zinc extraction, brass casting economical smelting reduces fuel costs for iron and copper smelting by 25 percent okay that's big news right there so there's a couple of things we, oh right here you have unlocked a steam engine which can build the nearest depot the engine is only installed on the locomotive the first car for this you need to expand it to four platforms whoa it's important to expand the first car and not build new cars man oh man all right well we've built new cars uh, we haven't done all of our expansions, and I don't think that we actually could. I don't know how that works. Um, but, yeah, I guess I would say if you were doing this at home, try to just expand the first car when you're starting off, right? That's all you really need to do. Uh, all right, so let's take a look at some things that we can do now. We can do that. Let me grab five of these and five of these. Let's make five more grease. Four. Five. Uh, so five more grease right there like that. We have now just one copper ingot. 
So we'll drop our one copper inside of there, and then we'll go ahead up here and drop these guys in there as well. So moving forward, I think the first thing that I want to do is reduce the smelting costs. So I'll need five and five. Um, I'm not ready to, to get that going yet. So uh, next order of business, I do believe we need a little bit of compound now. We'll take some five, five more compound. Uh, we'll need some fat. So if we see any fishes, we can access those. Uh, and then we're just going to need to get, uh, as always, massive amounts of scrap. We are about to arrive at the next depot. Uh, we're almost to the edge of the materials area. There's a little area where mats kind of stop spawning. Oh, it looks like we have something over here. Oh, nice, nice, nice. One of these guys. We're going to need this. We're going to need this eventually. Let's grab that guy right there. All right, so we're coming up with the depot. Let's pop over here. Dude, we have a lot of stuff and things now, too. Uh, X. No, X. F, F, place this guy down over here. Dude, we got a lot of that stuff. Nice. And we got three of the um, the chests that we got to figure out. But over here, guys, remember. Wait, I already have it in my inventory. That's right. The gun. Let's go ahead and grab our gun. And then I think I have ammo somewhere. I got 48 ammo. Is that going to be enough? I don't know. Let's go ahead and drop that chemical inside of there like that. Let's pop over into here and make a little bit of food, uh, water, I said. Uh, let's eat and eat and eat. And then we have extra water. Drink and drink and drink. Well, actually, hold on. And wait, what? Did I not make that? There we go. We can drink that in a second. And this guy needs fuel. Like so. All right, we're here. We're here. We get a reload going. I hope 48 bullets are enough bullets. Is that? Do you think it'll be enough? I have no idea. We can go ahead and drink this as well because I said we we're going to drink another drink. There we go. Use that guy right there. We actually only have 38 bullets now. We have our other gun as a backup. So that, that'll be fine. Let me... Maybe... Rare, don't, don't teleport yet. Don't teleport yet. Hold on. Inside of here. Bam. Consumables. Bullets. Weird. I can't make bullets? Okay. This is happening. <laughs> okay. This is happening. Oh, I need, I need the other thing. thing. I forgot. I need powder in order to make that. Oh, crap. All right. We're here. Okay. We're going to fight. There they are. Where's he at? I heard him. Dude, dude, they're everywhere. There it is. Okay, here, hold on. Let's get a little bit closer. Oh, headshot. Oh, two hits and you're down, you stupid and dumb. Blech. Let's push his body out of the way to make sure he doesn't have any good stuff on him. Okay, we're not doing too bad. Okay, this is the... They're rocking me a little bit. I'm trying to be... Ow! Die! I'm trying to be a little bit careful and not shoot too many shots. Oh my god! If I can help it. Holy crap, that was amazing! Oh, you guys. You know what I'm not noticing, though? I'm not noticing anything on the ground. Like, where are all my tokens and stuff? No tokens. There's a there's a gun part. No, that's not a gun part either. No tokens, no gun parts. Okay, one token. Dude, devs. Every single one of these guys should drop a token. This is bullcrap. There's another one. Alright, two tokens. And that's just that thing. Okay, so there's more bad hombres. There he is. Okay, hold on. Let's go up. Dun, 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 dun. Shroud type maneuvers. Dude, I'm so bad right now. Why can't I hit this guy in the head? <laughs> sorry, sorry. I snorted. Lol. All right, where's this other kid? I see you, buddy. I'm going to hit you in the head. I'm going to redeem myself right here. You ready? All right, we got another token. Dude, like no gun parts. Like none. I hope they didn't make a change. That was like the coolest part of the depots. It was like, you know, you got to do stuff and it kind of changed the game up. We really only got, we got three tokens and that was it from fighting all of those guys. Uh, I, I really do feel like we should have got more stuff. There might be more bad hombres. I didn't look. Sometimes in the upper right hand corner, it actually tells you how many guys there are. And I get really distracted. Uh, and I'm just kicking, kicking ass. So uh, I don't normally check. But I think that's it. Let me take a look here. Sounds pretty safe to me. Let's go ahead and do this. Let's start off with some tokens. We are hoping for... Oh, we got one of these guys. So, wait a second here. Prophecies. Speed of swimming in the void. Ten, minus 10%. That sounds not great. Why would I want that? What? Okay, I'm not really sure how this works. I think this is something that we're going to figure out later on. We're going to come uh, to understand that a little bit better. But, uh, okay, we got a prophecy. We're hoping for these guys right here. Oh, food. 
Oh, seeds. Oh, cool, man. We've yet to get any of these guys. Pepper seeds. All right, interesting. And one last. Womp, womp, womp. Whatever stupid, dumb organics. No one needs. All right, so we got a seed. That means that we kind of got to take a look at getting into this guy right here. We don't have a lot of room on the boat either. Uh, uh train. Um, we need to build one of these guys. Hey, give me that organic back. We're going to need that organic. You didn't fall through the ground, did you? All right, well, give me that organic back right there. Um, and let's go ahead and switch guns. Let us... Oh, that was our bullet spot, huh? Well, maybe we can put bullets in here with our throwing rings, like so. Let's go ahead and drop the seeds in there for right now uh, as well. I'm going to grab maybe that guy. And then what is it that I needed in order to build the deal? Hmm. All right, check it out. We'll put the garden up in a little bit. To start off with, let's just get everything kind of cleaned up here. Let's pop up over here. We'll drop those guys in there. Let's go ahead and get 10 more ingots on the smelt. Five, I should say. Five ingots on the smelt to use 10 scrap. Inside of here, we'll drop that. So that's five copper we have now. There. So our inventory is a little bit more well organized. Let me explore this place and just make sure I can get all the stuff and things. I'll just do all the busy work real quick. So I grabbed all the things. We got a couple of things that were valuable or worth. Let's go ahead and cook up that right there like so. Uh, and then what we're going to do is check over here. Do we get another Roth Limo? Yeah, we got another Roth Limo. We got a little, little this little guy right here. So we're going to grab this Roth Limo. Uh, I'm going to place him down over here, like so. And I think he actually faces backwards. It's really hard to see. I am going to rotate him around. Uh, being able to see while placing things would be great. I don't know. I'm just a tip, devs. Uh, all right. So now we got to find... There it is, the table. So check it out. we got to find this table. we got to grab these guys. Let's pop over here. Let's see what this is going to do for us. There should be different things that they're going to give us. But I'm not exactly sure. All right. Interact. Bam. Whoa. Whoa! A maze! Hold on. I mean, it's just a bunch of stuff. Bunch of resources. Not enough space. I mean, you're freaking kidding me, man. Okay, we got a ton of resources. All right, let's pop back over this way. Uh, any more room for wood? Wow, we really do not have any more room for wood. Well, that's a huge amount of uh, compound. Let's grab... We'll drop all those inside of there. We can drop that guy inside of there. So, chemical, I should say, not compound. We got three... Yeah, three dirty ice. We don't need that crap anymore. We can go ahead and make some more iron ingots over here. Like so. Five of those guys. And this is running out of fuel in a second. We can fill that up with five more fuel to make a little bit more room. Drop you in here. I kind of... Uh, we could make... Two more chemical. Grease, grease. Sorry, guys. There, like that. Let's drop in here. Inventory management is key. This is kind of like my favorite part of the game, to be honest with you. I really like the inventory management in this game. I like keeping everything organized in its little groups. I like making sure, like, all the... You know what I mean? Everything that I got is, like, in a, is a nice little spot. Let's grab that guy, uh, and we'll come over here and drop this as well. Interact. H, X. There we go. There we go. Let me grab that, that, and that really fast. All right, bam, 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 bam. I, some stuff keeps falling through the ground. Uh, very unfortunate. Again, the suggestion for the dev team, don't let things fall through the ground. I mean, I'm just throwing it out there. All right, let me... I can't pick that up. Okay, we got a couple of things we got to do here. Let's drop... Jeez, so much stuff. Uh, for right now, I'm going to drop this and this over here. I'm going to grab this food. We'll go ahead and fire up four more of these guys. We got that going. Uh, we have more ingots. We could drop those guys and top that off. And throw those in there. It's really the wood. Like, we just have so much. I don't even know what to do with it all, man. Uh, there's our grease that we made to top off that part. Uh, the leather, we can maybe squirt some more of that inside of there. Uh, looks like I can make actually five more ingots. <laughs> Like that. So we are doing really, really good here, man. Uh, let's go ahead and grab the rest of this stuff. And we have to open this last chest. So this is like the super chest. It's the nicer of all of the chests. We'll pop over here. Let's drop this guy right here. Oh, my God. Unbelievable and amazing. Oh, man. Oh, man. A huge amount of stuff and things. All right, I'm just going to leave some of that on the ground. I know some of it I'm not going to need. Oh my god, I have so much stuff now. Alright, so check this out, guys. We have one mushroom. It looks like these mushrooms don't stack. 
I'm going to... And also, it's funny. Right now, I'm slowed. Let's go ahead and give this mushroom to this guy. We've yet to do this. What's up, homie? You like that? Is that good? 294 seconds. What's that? Five minutes for 300 seconds? Dude, he's hammered. We got the raw flemo wasted. Super wasted, man. So we got to drop this guy as well. But remember, we need one. The the tutorial when we first did the raw flemo said we need to put them on different platforms. So uh, or different trains, I do believe, um, in order to get them to work. So we're going to have to build another one of those deals. Uh, we got some more seeds and we got... Here's what I'm going to do, guys. We got a lot more chemical, too. I'm going to drop that there. Dude, inventory management. I'm telling you. What do we got going on over here? More wood. All right. Let's get that going. And then over here, we have another mushroom. Some of that more seeds. I pick up that. Maybe that guy, that guy. Do I have room? No room for that. So we have more seeds, but I think we had some seeds in here. We could double up on that. And then I do believe we are good to go. So let's grab... That, we don't need that dirty ice. We don't need that chemical either. All right, sweet. So the next order of business that I want to see is, are we able to build more cars? So it says wagon platforms two of two. Uh, upgrade wagon. Oh, it says that we can. Oh, also, it says we have all the materials. Whoa, update. This has been updated. Let's do this. Bam! <clears throat> Bam. Sorry, I had to do it in a manly way. Um, They updated this so it pulls from the inventory of your actual train because the stuff that we needed from the train was inside of here. It didn't used to do that. That's freaking awesome. Also next order of business, speaking of all that wood we had, remember we had extra wood? Not anymore. All right. So I'm glad we kept an eye on those sorts of things. Uh, next deal. Let me go ahead and grab this guy. <gasps> what? How? What is happening? Did you see that? Oh my God, you guys. F? No, X? X? F? Okay. Okay. What? How did that happen? How did that just happen? I'm confused. I'm very confused. Pick this guy up. Okay. Um, don't tell the dev team, but something weird and cheaty is happening, and I got an extra chest. Um, I would like to place it here. Okay. More stuff and things, and a lot more of it. Okay. Metal for days. Dude, we have so much stuff now. This is crazy. Let's get pop over here. Oh, actually, I can't carry it all. <sighs> okay, inventory management is key. Let's just see what happens if I pick up another one of these. Oh, man. So it didn't work a second time. Oh, man. All right, hold on. Uh, X and then F. So I have no idea why that happened. I picked up one of these guys. And then suddenly there was a chest there. And the reason I'm doing this is just to kind of move them back here a little bit to make room for the Roth Limo. But now I feel like I have to try all of them just to make sure that we can't get another cheaty chest. Uh, I was really excited by the cheaty chest. Uh, the cheaty chest was probably one of the best things that's ever happened to me in this game. Oh, place right there. Uh, 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 like that, like this. Let's grab this guy. We'll F him over here like that. And then this guy, we will F this guy over here. So I have no idea why that happened. Uh, but I'll take it. I'll take the extra cheaty chest. 21 seconds on that guy. We have basically everything that is of uh, value already picked up over here. Um, actually, we can maybe get a little bit more fat now that I think about it. We have the one fat that dropped. We can always get fat, though. All right. So next order of business. Let's check it out. Inside here, the B menu, we need a bunch of stuff and things to build another rough limo nest. Inventory management's going a little bit better, and I've been grabbing a bunch of stuff and things, making all the stuff and things that I'm ready to do. Some stuff and things. That's right. Over here, we're going to go ahead and pop down another raw flemo nest. Being careful to rotate it to face us. Why it would face away, I have no idea. Uh, we're going to place that guy right there like so. We're going to grab this raw flemo here. And I'm going to place him right there. Look at this guy. We got a new raw flemo. So this guy's dark colored. Like, I don't know, dark purple or penguin colored or something like that. And this is our other guy. Now, I went ahead and give this guy one mushroom. And I was meaning to give the other mushroom to this Roth Limo. I accidentally fed it to this guy. We got 25 seconds to see what's going on. If I'm not mistaken, I thought that this gave us decor items. But it looks to me like I don't have any decor items over here. So I'm not exactly sure what happened with that. Uh, I don't see anything else. This is all the building that we can do. So I'm not really sure what this, how this works. So let's just wait a couple seconds here. We got five, four, three... I wish it stopped at three. That would be funnier. There we go. All right, there it is. We got new decor items. Hold on. So let's go back into our B menu, and then if we go to decor, 
Wait, wait, it's not there. Interesting. Oh, you know where it might be? What if it's up here? In this. Because if we select that. There! So we got handrails that we could build. Okay. So there's handrails that we can build. If we go to the previous car. Or no, next car? Previous car? Decor? Ah, train car sides. So it looks like it's specific to... I don't know, to which car, whatever kind of decor item you can build. That's what it looked like to me. All right, so that guy's going on over there. Wait, we got another thing we got to take a look at here. Check it out, guys. We need two more bolts and two organic. Now, do I have any organic lying around here? I have one over here. We have a bunch of stuff lying around. Grab that guy. And you know what else we could actually do? We could put all this stuff into this storage here. But for right now, it's fine. It is what it is. Uh, how many did we get? That's three right there. So we needed two of those guys. And what else do we need in order to build this bad ombre? Two bolts. Not a problem. Let's pop over here. Go ahead and make two bolts. Like so. Ten seconds there. Now, I wanted to see. I built two more bolts, two more springs, two more bearings. And I have four ingots. Can I expand this again? Bam. He's done it. Unbelievable and amazing. So much for all of our wood. Let's see if we can make four more of these guys because remember this needs to be four long believe it or not in order to get the locomotive on here so now we'll go back into our b menu like so pop this down bam 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 and bam all right and then how much wood do we have now remember that big stockpile of wood and i couldn't figure out the hell we we're gonna do with it we had too much wood for all the things yeah not anymore all right so let's grab those guys right there and then now are we able to build this all right so we can build this little garden thing i think a good spot for this might be way down here I'm going to place this guy very, very nicely organized right there. All right, sweet. And now we have some seeds. So we got two different types of seeds from our chest. We got these strange seeds. I'm going to plant those, I do believe. Strange plant. It's not clear what will grow out of this. Bam. Great. All right, 180 seconds, 6, 12, 18, 3 minutes. Um, and that will be done over inside of there. And then the other seed that we got were pepper seeds. So we have four uh, pepper seeds. All right, and uh, yeah, so we're good to go with that as well. So let me pop this down over here like so and like this. Now, let me, eh, let me drop that guy. We don't need that organic. How are we doing on food and water? Meh. All right, so what I'm feeling like, check this out, guys. I got, uh, five, what, 14 more ingots inside of there. And then what do we have over here? None. Okay, so I just have some copper. Wait, wrong, wrong deal. We'll throw that copper inside of there, and I have one extra uh, grease here. I want to build enough stuff to try to expand this one more time. I'm going to decide to see if we can get this to be the four long that we need it to be in order to put the locomotive on it. Two bolts, two springs, two bearings. And I'm going to pop back up over here. And let's see if we can make this uh, bigger again. Upgrade wagon. Bam. Look at that thing, man. It's huge. Dude, we've got it as long as we need it to get it. Um, We're going to need more wood for sure. So much for all of our extra wood. Let's grab that and that. I think it's only two per. So we have eight. This should be good to go. We can go into here, grab that, two, three, four of those guys. All right, so now in order to build the locomotive, I think we have to do that up here, I think. Let me see here. Build a module. There it is right there. So that's going to be, holy crap, man. Four, oh, it's the same thing. It's the same thing. So it's 10, 18, 20, 22 iron and four copper in order to build the uh the engine um and then we have to demolish our old engine before we can build it and i think our old engine is the trolley handle that's actually what is considered our engine um we also i do believe are gonna have to destroy these chests um i think the stuff on the sides will be able to fit but these chests the horn uh and this are all gonna have to go in, in lieu of the um the new engine that we're gonna have to build but we have a lot of gathering to do in order to get there so hold on a second here let's oh man everything's so far away now our train is, ma is absolutely massive okay so like that like that just taking and taking a look at all the things we got are you done is this our strange fruit four wood weird all right so that strange fruit gave us four wood and then i'm gonna grab our seeds right here it looks like this doesn't take any water this is really interesting and easy i like that so we'll plant our peppers inside of there. 700 seconds. That's like 12 minutes. Uh, a little over 11 minutes. All right. Well, you guys, a huge amount of stuff. Um, 
was gotten by me in this area, but I can't believe it. That's going to be it for today. All we had time to do. Um, our train car is getting massive. We're going to do some more gathering in the next episode. Um, can't wait to start working on expanding the platforms even more. Uh, can't wait to see what things are changing because it feels to me like things are changing in this game very, very quickly. Um, but yeah, if you guys had fun, hit the follow button, uh, follow button, hit the subscribe button, uh, hit the like button if you like the video. And again, a super huge shout out to everybody who supports the channel on Patreon. Uh, Patreon.com slash Slipgator. There's a link in the description if you'd like to become a supporter. Thank you guys very much for your support. I'll see you in the next one. May the stuff of things be with you.